Hola, I'm Monica Orozco and I'm filming this uh, video uh, to show in one way uh, what is uh, my method like a tango teacher and dancer. Uh, what is based on all my information and my, uh, my love and passion for this, da for this dance. Um, to be honest, um, I like to start not define it, my methods from the point of view of uh, what the students need to do or what the people need to know in order to learn tango, not only the dance, the movements, the culture and the passion of a beautiful dance. I just I want to start to do or say what the teacher need to do. So I like to define my role like a teacher. First, I think a teacher need to create conscience. The conscience is the first state of awareness where the people know what is located all the pieces of your body and that's building something. That's building the creation of a movement in an art form. How we live both together that journey and makes the things be aware for you. That's the first thing, create conscience of a space, of a body, of a mind, of a love, of a music, of a be with somebody, paying attention to somebody. Second, when you are ready to, uh, to have that conscience, you create the memory of that conscience. And that is based on tools, different tools, like one of the most beautiful tools in the Argentine tango is the walk, the art of walk. Nothing is possible, like Picasso in the painting. You cannot do the tango if you don't walk properly. Nice, beauty, with feeling, with sensitivity, dynamic. Then later we're going to see different movements. That is Tuz. That is Tuz who's going to build in you in a beautiful tango dancer. Because it's not about the steps, it's about how you produce and make the step in an art form. Tango is a feeling. This is a journey. Tango is a journey, which is students and teachers live to, uh, together and they willing to live and embrace that feeling. You know, the most beautiful part is the process and that's what I love in the teaching is the process, how they became from a little child and also, I don't say child in base in age, child in a spirit, child in the knowledge of the dance and they became really professional, really grown up in the feelings of tango. The third thing is create harmony, create expectations. So what that means, I said it, the role of a teacher is first, create conscience, I repeat it. Second, tools and memory. And third, expectation. So expectation is create a reason to move. The leaders move the partner and the par partners follow. You understand? So we enter now in another conception, for example, what means to be a leader and what means to be a follower. In the case of the follower, creating the follower, the power of surrender. This is very important because when you start to move, when you start to create something, the most important thing is to know what you have inside and what is the meaning of the concept. For example, if we're talking about the leading or to be a leader, the most important thing is to understand what it means to be a leader. And I can say in a few words, for example, 
Leader is never wrong. Leader know where he need to go. Leader is clear. Leader is secure. Because nobody follow a leader insecure. You understand? And that not means leaders are right or wrong to be accepting to follow, to don't think, understand, and um, and go forwards with the with the desires of our leaders, and that create the 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 intentions of the couple. Well, I don't want to go too many many details about what is this beautiful dance give to the people and I said too many times uh, it's not about the dance because in the in the dance form the dance is very rich in, in movements and music like a, like any kind of dance ballet or flamenco high level of dance have is rich but in another size have a very 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 cultural philosophical a spiritual journey which is I want to go there and then one of the last things when I, when I want to mention the first piece is how we define the movements in the terms of dynamics uh, in the terms of feelings because the only, the only reason why somebody, a leader propose a leader a lead or the followers fall is based on the music and there are three things very important to follow in the music first is rhythm second is melody and third is harmony I just want to say if you define if you move that three concept, concepts to a movement you can get what we're talking in the beginning the art of walk in your tango, in your, in your Argentine tango. I think it's beautiful and we can talk about many, many, many more things and